Well, what are we fixing today? Today we're in the cottage basement. And I think on the last video I said we moved something up there so we could do something with something and put something and then something. And then I said something a couple more times. Not sure. Anyway, we're going to continue that thought. Today, we're going to work on... What is it? That. Remember a video from that? I think I'll put a link to it up here somewhere. And uh, I said, you know, that's kind of messy. We should kind of fix that. So we're going to fix all that right now. So I had bought myself this for a different project. And I haven't even opened it up yet because the other project I didn't need it for. So... Let's open this up. This is for hiding cables. Makes a huge difference. So we'll see about that. I don't know what is in here. Stuff, 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 stuff. Talking about stuff. stuff. So this is some kind of a cable raceway. I assume I'm going to mount it to the wall in some way. Here's some corners. Here's some corners the other way. Here's some flats. I don't know where you're supposed to put the screws. I don't see holes in that. I don't see holes in this. So, one of the rare, rare cases where we're going to do this. Just kind of look at it. All right. Play on the rut. <laughs> Measure it. Cut the channel. Mark it. Apply the tape. Ah, tape. Stick to the wall, put in the cables, put on covers, install with screws. Just drill wherever you want and put them wherever you want. <laughs> okay. Yeah! Let's do that. Let's just do what we want. So, you have just experienced my checking the documentation, written documentation to install something, maybe the only one you'll see all year long. All right. Would like this to sit a little better straight, but it doesn't. And I think I'm just gonna say that's okay. All right. What is this one? Is this a power plug? I don't like the way that's wrapped around now. I don't think that's going to work. Get this straightened out. Let's see how this goes. Looks like I can slide it out or pull it out. This looks like the back. This looks like the front. I just want to see how this fits in here. It's going to have to be flat, flat, flat. Of course, I got enough of them. Something to be said for sticking the AC line somewhere else. Isn't there?
because the AC line can certainly cause interference. And I think I'm going to be too tight to get all this into this little thing, right? So, if the AC line is going to get its own thing, since I have six of these, probably only going to need two. Yeah, two is plenty. So I only use four of them as it is. It says you can stick them or you don't have to. All right. So I think I want to need a couple of these. These are the straight connections. So, how does this work? And you just kind of put it over the top. This is going to be on there like that. And then you just do that. Well, it's gonna... All right. I'm putting the small side back. So off to the side over here. I'm going to put the AC cable. And possibly the coax for the antenna. But we'll, because that's well shielded. So we'll see. I need a level and a pencil. Now one thing I always check is this is the level decent uh, that rocks. So that looks like it's like right on. That looks like it's like right on. So this level is pretty good because if I put it this way or this way, it says about the same thing. So uh, off to the side, maybe like here. Uh, looks pretty good to me. I'll draw that line. Now this is going to go along that line. Okay, now I'm looking at this. I see, so I just saw something. See how this is square? See how this is tapered on the edges? And guess what? This is also tapered on the edges. So I got a feeling that means this goes back. So, change my mind mid sentence. We're doing it this way. I get it. Yep. All right. I got it for length. Okay, so kind of like there. All right. Number two. Start exactly where the other one ended. 
Follow the lines down. Actually, let's do this. Let's give me the best chance of making it right. So for now, let's take the power cord, snap that one in there, power cord is not shielded, it puts out a bunch of noisy crap, it's always good practice to not have that in the same raceway as signal wires that I have. Audio, video, signal wires, and the antenna. But the antenna is shielded, so if I had to put anything in with it, it would be the shielded antenna. I should put a right angle on the top just because I can. Because I'm not going to use them any other way. So I'm going to put this on the top just to make it kind of nice. Straight connection. This comes out to the power. Awesome. To be honest, this is actually a power wire too, isn't it? I mean, it's DC power, but not signal. And this one will power into there, and that one will power into there. Let's move this out of the way for now because other things are happening with that. All right. Now, make a second line. Just run it this way. about the same height. Or something. Not that I'm there kind of hold it in place. And then this line at the line. There we go. Uh, 
have here with the big fat one in the back and the skinny ones in front. Okay, it's a little too tight here. So, this one I think we're going to have to do after. Because... Now we have... Step two. Here is step two. This full fireplace was upstairs in the living room. I didn't like it up there. But I didn't hate the thing. So we're going to put it there. Um, and that's all got to go. So the first thing I'm going to do is get rid of, or move this to the side. Okay. Now underneath here is some stuff. Including a cover for a remote, a Chinese water feature. I don't know. Here's more of the water feature. clock radio, but it's a while since you've seen one of them with the little flips on it. Some awesome daffodils. A book about greenhouse gardening. Everybody wants that, let me know. An old VHS. And there's a stereo in here somewhere. What's this? Oh, part of a coax. What's that? Don't know. I don't know if the stereo isn't working, so I don't think that's going back. More garbage. Well, there's a few other things in here. So, you can see the construction on this thing. It's all hollow back here. This, this is all fiberglass. This is wood. And that's a metal looking thing. This is going to end up staying on top here. This outlet strip, to be honest, should be mounted in here. Oh, I can set it. I don't know if you can see. I'm just going to set the outlet strip on, on top there. Because that doesn't get hot. It's not like it's fire or anything. So I can sit there. Let's get this back against the wall. I'll get, I'll get it where I want it. Needs to be kind of centered on the TV, which means that way away. 
Still. Yeah, that's pretty close. Now, the fire. That is the fire. Insta fire. Oh, look. We have fire. There. And there it is. Give you a little bit closer look, or actually a farther away look. And yeah, that thing wants to tilt a lot, so maybe I can tighten that up. I don't know. But there's a little TV, and there's the fake faux, fake faux, full fake fireplace. The DVD VCR. If you look at the cable raceways, they go up that far on the site pretty much the power is coming down here the two power wires and then here is the signal wires that kind of goes down behind below where you can't see it anymore and everything is fine and dandy so that's my video for today Remember the peacocks? They're still there. Um, remember that thing? It's in the wagon. It's going home for e-waste. And remember the lake? Yeah, lake's still there. Nice, right? All right. So, get back to where you can see me. That, oh, I know, we're spinning around like we're nuts. We're going to do this. And look at the full fireplace and the raceway cables. So, that's my video for today. Give me a like if this is good content and you liked it. Uh, if you have anything, you know, if you have any ideas, and especially like, how can I fix that clock? Because <laughs> that clock don't work. And I don't know if I want to make it work because then I gotta wind it, but you know, it's there. Um, and I said, um, again, see, I'm so good at um in the end because I have to think about what I'm saying and it makes everybody crazy. So I'm trying to like edit those out and make them not happen, but they happen. Subscribe if you can. I love subscribers. Uh, help me out in other ways down below. You can take a look and, uh, that's it for today. Oh, and on your way out. I want to show you one more thing. We're going to go outside. And say goodbye. In front of the last of the tulips. So until next time, may your tulips always look fresh. Bye.